This portrait is of Edna May Lindsay, and the photo was taken in 1929, and is uh, part of a series which I think is some pretty amazing, compelling portraits from the 1920s in Sydney, Australia. And it's a collection of mugshots. People um, allegedly committed crimes and were photographed and the photographs are so beautiful and it's a time traveling adventure through through these images it's just so beautiful and thank you very much jane my friend jane gillette who suggested that i check out these portraits because there are just so many wonderful faces to draw and yeah i'm sketching with the helitz calligraphy pen on nostalgi paper and inspired by this series of portraits today's sketch session we draw every tuesday at 7 30 pm german time we're going to do a series inspired by the theme of mugshots which i think is really interesting and it's when I look at these photos, this this time traveling, uh, I just, you know, it conjures up this kind of idea about the history, the what was going on in these people's lives, uh, what was life like at that time, a hundred years ago compared to now, so interesting, and and also the in the context of mugshots and that these people supposedly have done something wrong and what in their circumstances could have led to these uh, the decisions that they make and also particularly interesting uh, being Australian myself to to kind of wonder about this part of Australia's history which I know very little about so it was fun drawing this piece and kind of uh, reading up on these stories and this this exhibition. There's a travelling exhibition at the moment called uh, Underworld uh, Mugshots from the Roaring Twenties. Yeah, and it just so beautifully photographed. It's such an amazing story in, in each one of these faces and such interesting characters. And they're also stylish. I think each one of these mugshots, you'll, I'll put the link below, you can check out a few of them. Um, they, they just look so, so stylish, so cool. So really interesting and fun reference to draw from. And I decided and this is such a lovely dark background that I wanted to grab my ink and brush just to, to fill in the background. Because uh, it makes the, the contrast and see making the, the portrait really sing there. So it's the first time I've done this in a while. So it was interesting to to whip out the, the ink and brush and just to help set establish that contrast. So yeah, thanks so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed. Be sure to like and subscribe for more of these videos.